Amazon. Terve terve my summer carers! In the previous three parts we have sorted out all the problems with the engine except for the starter and the alternator. But today we will analyze everything related to gear shifting. Subscribe to the channel, I try to make the most useful and detailed guides. To begin with, let's exclude the moments related to the game settings. The game simulates a manual transmission and you have to press the clutch to change gear. In my summer car, this applies to Satsuma, Rusko, Tractor, Wen and Truck. There is a button for the clutch in the K-binding. Without pressing on it, you will not be able to shift gear until you turn on the auto clutch parameter in the game. If it is on, you no longer need to manually press the clutch. While you are in the menu, check which buttons are assigned to shift gears up and down. This is in case the buttons are not set. Once we've done with the menu, let's see what can happen to Satsuma itself. I have already said that you need to press the clutch to change gears. It is a composite device for disconnecting the engine from the gearbox. The connection is provided by a tight contact of the clutch disc and the flywheel. The clutch disc wears out. When its condition becomes very bad and you press the throttle too hard, the engine loses its connection with the gearbox and revs go into a red line. If you play on a keyboard where the throttle can take either true or false values, it gives you hard times. In this case, when the throttle pressed, white smoke will come out of the clutch. As soon as the pedal is released, the smoke will stop. This is how you can tell the smoke from the clutch from the smoke caused by a head gasket or pistons. It is unlikely that you killed the clutch disc completely, but if this happens, the car will not even move. There is a special window for replacing the clutch disc on the gearbox. On the screen I detached the clutch cover plate. Now I am removing the drive gear. To remove the clutch, you should unscrew the bolts and rotate the clutch itself by hand. Next, remove the disc from the clutch basket and go to the mechanic. Until this bug goes away, I will not stop repeating. In order to buy a spare part or pay something at mechanics, you need to look right inside the cash register. Further assembly is done in the reverse order. To my surprise, the clutch continues to work if you unscrew the clutch pedal, one bolt by nine, and the clutch master cylinder, two bolts by eight. Moving further along the device, the game pleased me. A fully fixed drive gear, 7 bolts by 6, after a while fell off. The clutch disconnected, the car stopped and did not go further. Unscrewed clutch basket showed an even more interesting result. The car revs in gear, but doesn't move at all. Anyone who can't understand why Satsuma doesn't move, pay attention to this. The clutch master cylinder must be filled with brake fluid, otherwise the hydraulics will not work. As a result, the engine will also rev, not moving the car. The liquid flows out if two nuts by seven on the lining are not tightened. In the game, fluid leakage is visible to the eye. Have you checked everything? Let's go further. If the gear changes to neutral while shifting, this is a sure sign that it's time to change the gearbox. There are three types for this breakdown. It knocks out either both first and third gear, or second and fourth, or only reverse gear. To replace the box, you will have to lift the engine. Usually, I prefer to disassemble it as much as possible to avoid problems in the future, for example with glitchy half shafts. Remove the hood and the battery, first negative, then positive terminal. Detach the ignition coil with wires and the fuel strainer. Loose the clamps and remove the pipes. In this case, after repair, you will have to fill in new coolant. Unscrew the bolt on the hub by 14 and 3 bolts by 9 on the half shafts. Again, this is the most buggy part, you will see this next. Remove the drive gear. 
Using the wrench by 5, unscrew the gear linkage. Carefully drag the motor hoist to the engine. Tighten two bolts by 10 on the links. I forgot to remove the heaters. Remove three bolts by 11 from the subframe. Just in case, I unscrewed the bolts from the starter. After removing the engine, the wires that go to the starter will disappear. Unscrew 6 bolts by 7 and 1 by 10 at the gearbox itself and go to the mechanic. Since we detached the spare part, there will be a new one on the shelf. Again, in experimental branch, the mechanic has glitchy cash register. You need to look directly inside it to pay for the new gearbox. Put everything together in reverse order. Screw back 6 bolts by 7 and 1 by 10 on the gearbox. Lower the engine until the bolts appear on the subframe. 3 by 11. Then unscrew 2 bolts by 10 on the hoist and take it away. Put back the gear linkage. 3 by 5. Attach the drive gear. 7 by 6 and we move on to the nightmare, the half shafts. Let me explain, I always take them off when I take off the engine because they are always buggy. You can see it even now, I had to install them twice. One bolt by 14, 3 by 9 on each side. The half shafts glitch has the same signs that broken clutch has. The engine revs, the car stays still. To solve this, detach them completely from the car Save the game, install again, tighten them and save the game again. Put the rest of the parts in the reverse order. Just do not forget to tighten the clamps on the pipes, otherwise the coolant will flow out. Whenever the engine is removed, you will have to wire it again. Here we have two wires for a positive and a negative terminal. Tighten the terminals first plus, then minus, check all liquids that could leak out of your Satsuma. If you enjoy this guide, please like it, and we will move on to other reasons why the gearbox don't work properly. The operation of the gearbox is affected by loose bolts on the gear stick. 3 by 6. First, the gear switches to neutral, then the stick itself may fall off. The loose bolts on the gear linkage 3x5 have similar signs, it again switches to the neutral gear and the part falls off. Loose bolts may result in switching off from any gear. A broken gearbox always knocks out a specific pair. Some update introduced a lot of sounds to the game, including the noisy whine of the gearbox. Nothing can be done with it, this is fine. If I helped you, subscribe to the channel. When it reaches 1000 subscribers, I will release the most useful guide that uncovers all the problems with electrics and you will find the answer to the question why Satsuma won't start or won't drive. Thank you for your attention, stay well!